back at the No BS Mortgage Scenario Board. Here's what we're looking at today. We have a customer here that makes about 117,000 for the year. High FICO score, 760. She has $83,000 in a savings account that she has to work with. Her monthly debt is $450 and that all consists of credit card debt. The type of loan we're gonna be looking at right here is a conventional loan and then she's gonna be looking at condos as well. Let's take a look at the numbers, see what it looks like. After running the numbers, here's what we came up with. She's looking at a purchase price of about $600,000. She's gonna put down 10%, so it's about $60,000 out of her pocket. Her closing costs are roughly about $12,000. In this scenario right here, the sellers were not working with this at all, so the seller credit is zero, along with the lender credit is zero as well. That's associated with the interest rate. Her cash to close out of pocket completely is gonna be about $72,000. Here's the monthly breakdown of her payment. Her mortgage insurance is pretty low because her credit score is high. So it pays to have a high credit score when you're doing a conventional loan. Total payment, 4402. The rate we're going with is 5.875 in this scenario. The advice I'd give to this person right here is focus on paying off some of this credit card debt uh, just to free up some space on your monthly budget because we're maxing you out on your monthly payment for a mortgage. We don't want you to be cash poor. So I would focus on continuing to pay down this monthly debt so you just narrow it down to you having just your mortgage payment. If you have any questions or scenarios, shoot me a DM or leave a comment down below and make sure to follow for more No BS Mortgage Tips.